Hi guys, Kirby and Ducks here with a quick and easy recipe for mango sago punch. So if you're from the Caribbean, you're familiar with this. We have many recipes like this for porridge. But in other parts of the world, this is known as tapioca pearl. And we're going to make a delicious drink with this. I'm going to start by heating up two cups of whole milk. And we're going to go in with a half a cup of our tapioca pearl or sago. Give it a quick rinse. And then we're gonna add it to our warming milk that we're bringing up to temperature. And we're gonna continuously stir this to prevent it from catching on the bottom. So, we're gonna prepare our mangoes as well. This is a Maha Chinook mango that I got from my neighbor. It's super delicious and sweet. So this is how I prepare my mango sago punch. We're gonna score our mango after we slice off the fleshy part and we're gonna go in cross section to make it into little cubes and then I'm gonna take a spoon and scoop it out so just a little note here the kids absolutely love this they love crunching on the little pearls and they love the flavor of mangoes, so I combine it together to give them a quick treat. And this is how we do it. We score a mango horizontal and diagonal. And then I take a spoon and scoop it up, as you will see. Just like this, we have a little mango chunks. Now I'm gonna use half of the mango chunks to blend up. I'm gonna go in with a half a cup of carnation evaporated milk. And we're gonna blend this up into a puree. Use my magic bullet and give it a swirl. And within seconds, we have a delicious puree that I'm gonna set to the side. And the remainder of the mango that I'm saving for chunks to be placed. We're gonna put it to chill. I'm gonna go in with one teaspoon vanilla essence. A little bit of cinnamon. And a little bit of nutmeg. And this is to make our punch nice and delicious and flavorful. And we're gonna continuously stir this so it doesn't stick to the bottom of the pot. We're cooking on very low heat here. So we're gonna continuously stir that in. Now I'm going in with some sugar here. This is our jaggedy sugar. This is unrefined sugar. And now we're gonna add a little bit more milk because it's been thickening. Now I'm gonna cut the heat off, let it cool down, and I'm gonna add my mango chunks along with my mango puree, and give it a nice swirl. Give it, let it mix well, and then I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator to cool, and then we'll serve it up. And here you have it guys, our delicious mango sago punch. Or if you wanna call this our mango tapioca punch, Put it in a glass, nice and chill, and we're ready to enjoy.